guys, it is 2 p.m. People, VIP is just about to come in through these doors behind me. People walking in, ready to pour some wine, have a lot of good eats, quite a bit of food that you're going to see coming up, and uh, just people here to have a good time. Tons of wines from all over Lodi, Woodbridge, and the neighboring areas. The food especially is going to be amazing, like my fifth time being here, so very excited. So what would you say is your uh, your favorite wine out of the spread today? I would have to go with the Cab Reserve. It's uh, definitely our most award winning wine. It's one of the best cabs in Lodi, I would say. Um, you guys have to try that one next. Really good. <laughs> with Wine and Roses Resort and Spa. Today we're doing a maple smoked uh, salmon in-house with a homemade rice cracker for a for a savory savory bite. And over here we have a homemade uh, organic strawberry and rhubarb pie with a meringue topping. And of course, try it with wine. Southern pimento cheese spread. We have a New York cheddar, English cheddar, and mac and cheese soup. Not your typical there cheese you ball. Thank you. Yeah, of course. You want to try it in English? So Mettler Family Vineyards, we've been here in Lodi for six generations since the 1800s. Before that, we have two generations going back to actually making wine in Germany. So we're a German-based family. We've been on the same property for over 100 years here in the Lodi area. And we do it all. We are growers, we are farmers, we are winemakers, and own the winery. And so everything that we do at Mettler is um, all estate, and we are what they call certified green. So we do our vineyards with uh, organic and uh, third-party Lodi rules, third-party sustainability. We just acquired a location, it's under construction, and as soon as that's ready to go, um, we'll put it on social media so that everybody knows where it's at. And it will be open late, so everybody will have somewhere to go in the evenings. But on Facebook, it's called Lodi Crepes. You can find me on there. Okay? Thank you. favorite wine that you offer here at uh, Y Bell? My favorite is the almond. It's not overly too sweet, but it's not really dry to me anyways. So that's why it's my The favorite. almond's kind of an in-between flavor. It's one of our top sellers. It's won multiple awards. Um, very popular. This year, recently, um, won a silver in the San Francisco Wine Chronicle uh, wine competition. It goes great with orange juice. It does. It <laughs> actually is <laughs> true. That's true. It's a very good mimosa base, right, for orange, sure. Yes. I really like it with like spicier foods, like Thai foods. Mm. Um, kind of, it's not overly sweet, but the sweetness it does have does kind of cut like the yeah. yes. cut the spice. Just gives it a perfect balance. All right. We do have a tasting room in downtown Lodi. Uh, it's going to be located on 9 oh, yes. North School Street. You could occasionally find them in other locations, but it's we don't really have a distribute. We don't distribute wine very much, so you're going to have a better chance Enjoy. finding it in our tasting room. Double Dip Gallery is fine art and ice cream. You walk by 49 feet of art to get to Gunther's Ice Cream. One of the best ice creams that have been open since 1940. Really good ice cream. And we also have Michael David's Petite Petite Syrah made into a sorbet. Really good. 
really good. And we're also featuring Tony's art. He's a, a few pieces. A few. A few. Open seven days a week. DoubleDipGallery.com. Double Dip Gallery on Instagram, Facebook as well. Yes. This is my Aunt Nancy's authentic Scottish shortbread recipe. She's been making it for years casually for holidays, and now she's decided to go public with it. These are my parents back here. <laughs> Hi, guys. Hi. Uh, it's facebook.com slash Nancy. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you.